Hi guys, it's Mick and Andrew from Tots Coaching. Over the next four to five weeks, we're going to put some short videos together, probably one a week, so that the children can do some kind of activity at home, either with their sibling or with their parent. Here we have our first warm-up game, Fox and Hounds. Tuck the bib into the back of the child's shorts and get him to run around in a small area. The idea is that the uh, parent has to go try and pinch here at the child's bib and then tuck it into their shorts or joggers and then they have to run around and the child has to try and pinch uh, their bib. <laughs> So here we have everybody's favourite domes and dishes. What you can see from the short video is some of the cones are turned the correct way, some of them are turned upright. Anthony's moving around in the small area. Once he gets to a cone, he turns it the opposite way around, then he moves to another one and does exactly the same. Here we have domes and dishes again with a slight variation. What Anthony's doing here, if he goes to a red cone and turns it over, he then has to go find another red cone and turn it over. So what he's doing is co coordinating the colours. <laughs> In this next clip, we have a game of Ghostbusters. Choose one person to be the Ghostbuster. The role of the Ghostbuster is to run around and knock down the cones as they are the ghost. The role of the other person is to pick them back up upright. Try 30 seconds in one role, then swap over. Bags are fun to play with your child. This has to be my favourite game, Swap Shop. What we've done, we've put some items on top of the cones and then Anthony's moving around, picking them up, and taking them from one cone and putting them on an empty cone. We've used things like bibs, balls, I believe there's a mobile phone there, keys. Use your imagination if you haven't got any balls, you can use children's toys or tea towels or anything like that. In the next few video clips, you'll see me and Anthony passing items backwards and forwards to each other. We start off with a bib. When the bib is being caught, try and get the kids to scrunch them into a really small ball before they throw it back. I believe then we move on to a ball. Last one is incorporating a skill we've used before by rolling on the floor, getting the child to pick it up and pass it to the adult. After three or four times, swap over the rolls. Don't set your child up for failure by uh, having the distance between you two great. If they're at a stage at the moment where they can't catch the ball or the bib, don't stress too much. Just trying to make it as much fun as possible. Mm -hmm. 